year old. This is Gene Simmons of the rock group KISS in 1982. This is Gene Simmons with KISS after the band cleaned up its act, so to speak, and lost the makeup. Now Simmons is back in makeup of a different sort for his role in the upcoming spy film, Never Too Young to Die. Simmons is playing entertainer Velvet Von Ragnar, a character who needs a bit of explanation. The character I play is supposed to be this sort of uh, very bad person, but has mixed sexual sort of ideas in his mind. It is a hermaphrodite, half man, half woman. And uh, I was born this way. So the Lord's been good to me, don't you think? While Simmons plays the villain in the film, John Stamos and Vanity team up to solve a murder. I thought my father's death was an accident. I thought you said you didn't care about it. Don't throw Steven out there like that and leave me hanging. Come on. Something I've always dreamed of being a spy. It's more like the James Bond woman. I hope that that's what it comes across as. I think I'm a little bit meaner. I don't know. <laughs> Stamos, who is best known for a long-running role on General Hospital, makes his feature film debut in Never Too Young to Die. It's been great. I, I just have more time to, to really get into my character, I think. And I sometimes I, I can tend to slough off, you know, uh, on TV, just kind of whiz through it. And I'm here, I'm really, I have the time to concentrate and, and I really uh, prepare and work up for my scenes, you know, before. Autograph. To Billy with love. So it's interesting to walk around with this stuff. You walk differently because I've got these high stiletto heels. See over there? And it comes all the way up. Along the way there are various things that are sort of interesting. It's a combination of pleasures.